may a silent woman, but when she speaks, her words rock. She has decided to send a direct message to Yole Doche. You know, Yole Doche is still thinking, hoping that maybe, who knows, one way or the other, something could turn the heart of May towards him and maybe finally she will accept this polygamy. I don't know if uh, they took blood oath when they were younger, but you know, none of these things are working. None of it is working as May decided to send a direct message. Now, this is in response to Yule Doche's message, direct message to May. And regardless if it is Juju Austin, Enugu Bag of Rice, Juju Ekwensu, if she's the one behind the keyboards writing, we don't care. We don't care. As long as Yule Doche saw that message and agreed to it, then we want to believe that he is the one writing these things. So, some couple of days ago, May dropped some very pretty looking pictures of herself and videos and people applauded and they, they went to her page. They're like, you know what? In fact, on, on, on comment section, I saw a lot of people arguing. No, she's in, not in Europe. She's in the US. She's this and I, and I laughed like, <laughs> I like this because it shows the power of social media. It shows what social media can do. Social media can either build your life and make it positive or it can mirror, reduce your life. That's what it is, depending on what kind of person you are and what you are portraying. So some people commented and they said some things to me. They said, please, 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 enough of this picture. Please do not put more of these out there because you are really dealing with the mental health of Juju Ekwensu and his baby, our baby husband, your is in Mili Odegu. You are dealing with your mental health. Please do not, do not post too much of this. It is, it is getting them crazy. They are not normal anymore. Because whenever you drop this picture or video, Juju Austin, or is it your? We don't care anymore. They will begin to post pictures and the popular picture, the famous picture, let's say the infamous picture that they like to share is that of both of them inside of a car praying. <laughs> it's so funny. We've never seen Juju Ekwensu in a kitchen cooking and, you know, doing this couple goals and acting. Is it that both of you are arguing? You're acting crazy on the street. There is nothing meaningful in what both of them put out there so whenever may post a picture real picture video of reality of our life living good they will quickly jump to do their own so yule doche wrote this on his timeline and of course we know what it means i'm going to tell you what he wrote but before then let us do something for this channel by liking and sharing and also tapping on the thanks button to encourage us returning subscribers i say thanks for returning um those that have been here on this channel we you know all the way i say thank you for remaining for those who comment thank you for your comments and if you're just coming across this channel kindly tap on the subscription button and turn on the notification bell it is free so you let Deutsche, like i said wrote this and we know who he is referring to he said that he cannot be replaced. And this was written immediately. May started posting pictures and videos. You know, it was too much for him. He now went behind his keyboard and wrote, I, Odogu, Isimili, this and that. I can never be replaced. And I'm like, wow, this guy is 40 something. He's still living in a fool's paradise. Uh, come on, when will you be wise? Well, you know, May, even though she's a quiet woman and she's not in for this social media ranting, she prefers to deliver. And when she delivers, she will throw bombshell videos and pictures like this, showing reality, showing that she is happy. Well, she wrote this, a direct message to y'all, Edoche. And she said, I am living my life already. I have moved. Now, this, this is a good one. She she actually put Yole Doche in the right position that it belongs to and also corrected that narrative. You know, back in those days when we had um, 
less women who could be productive. The only thing they do is to mind the children and home, regardless of their education. And the man wants to be the man here and there. But we live in a world where a woman can be, you know, also productive, add value. I'm not saying disrespect your husband or look down on your man. And, you know, no, that's not what it is. You are supposed to be companion. So it kind of erased that narrative that when marriage fails, a woman's life has ended, a light has dimmed. No, that narrative has changed. It is now clear, seeing the power of social media, that a woman, just like a man, possibly attended the same school, wrote the same exams. So why can't that man, as he is excelling, the woman is also excelling? So there is nothing like uh, somebody can be kicked in one corner because you are a woman. No, 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 it doesn't work that way. You are also in this world to create value. So create value in your home and also create value around yourself. Nobody has a right to bully the other person, neither a man or a, wo or a woman. None of you have the right to bully each other. Respect is reciprocal, of course. Two captains cannot be on a ship and you expect the ship to go in the right direction. A man has always been the head of the home. And that is not to make you a narcissistic person or a crazy man in the house, even when your decisions are stupid and foolish, even when you know that you know it, you know it as a person. Don't feel like you're a duche. You know that when it comes to setting a management, you, you lack it, you don't have it. Your wife is... An A-list in that department. Allow her to make that management decision. All you have to do is to just put a stamp on it. Like, okay, all right, I think uh, we should do it. And I guess you want to, just to make yourself feel like you're a man, just say, okay, we'll do it in the next one hour. So you can be like the driver. But don't put yourself where you know as a man, your ability is zero or non-existent. This is how to make your family move forward. But there are some men, because uh, the woman is smart, the woman is good here, they've refused to see inside of them what they are good at. They are busy chasing, uh, don't you know I'm a man? Don't you know I'm the man of this? In fact, whenever you hear a man say so, don't you know that I'm the man of the house? You should know that he has already lost it. You are not the man, because you don't need to say it, you know? <laughs> so, back to what I'm saying. So our response to Yole Doce is, I am living my life beautifully. What else? What else? When a woman is saying, I am living my life beautifully, she has already put a lot in that word, beautifully. That's it. She does not need you to compliment her anymore. You are non-existent. She doesn't want you to dim her light. It's as simple as ABC. So women also, it's the same thing. It's the same thing. It's the same thing. When you are faced with a failed marriage, you should know that there is light at the end of the tunnel. It's as simple as that. Failed marriage. I'm not saying a woman that frustrates a man, try to create turmoil, storm. You know, we have crazy women also out there. Same as we have crazy men out there. We have narcissistic women out there. Same as we have for a man also. So it's not only about men throwing shade to arrows at men. No. Also, we have bad women. Okay. Is Juju Austin a good woman? Drop your comment, like and share, subscribe to this channel. See you guys in the next update.